Hey guys, half mob here, and today I've got another Minecraft show for you. So this is going to be my version of Mumbo Jumbo's Tree Bomb. So in the description will be a link to his video and his channel. So as you can see, this tree looks just like one you'd find in the wild. So go up, mine it, and almost instantly you blow up. Okay, so to begin, what you need to do is find a oak tree and to make sure it's not one of the giant oak trees and it's just an average size. So what I need to do is go to the top of the tree, dig down two blocks in the centre, place a note block, and then place leaves on top of that note block. I chose a note block because a note block is very similar to oak wood, so if you just look in, it's quite difficult to see. Next what we want to do is dig a 3 by 3 hole underneath the centre of the tree and make sure it's 4 deep. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. And then just the whole way around here. And this is going to give you your place for your redstone to go. In the centre of this hole, place a piston facing upwards. So this will be right underneath the trunk of the tree. Then what you need to do is place uh, two hoppers here and place them facing into each other and throw an item in it. Nope, I completely missed there. Throw an item into it and place a block on top. Then place a redstone competitor facing over it to check if it's working. Then place a block to fill in from the trunk to the piston. I'm choosing oak wood just because when you destroy the block it'll make it look like a tree again. Then place a redstone competitor and that's the bit that's going to push up the tree as soon as the block's destroyed. Next what we want to do is place a redstone torch to the left of where the competitor is facing on this block. Then on top of that place another block with a redstone torch facing away from where the competitor is. Then place a block here and place redstone on top of it. This redstone should connect to the torch and then where the redstone is facing place a block there. So this redstone will be facing into this block. Diagonally down from that block place two more blocks and then place a power trail on the first one. So when this redstone is powered it will power this power track. Make sure this power track is facing long ways though. This is where the minecart of TNT will go. You can then fill in here, here, and round here. Make sure not to fill in this block, or the minecarts won't explode. Then what you want to do is stand where the powered track is, and dig a too high, too high hole, and dig it too long. Then dig down one extra one at the first point. Then what you need to do is find the certain bit in the rail that you can place multiple main carts on. So I'm going to place five just for an example. But you can place as many as you want. The more you place, the bigger the explosion. And the more likely you will to kill the person you want to trap or kill but you want to use a trap on. Then make sure you just cover everything up. And there you go. So now what you have is this tree that looks normal, but when one of the bots gets destroyed pushed up and explode. If you enjoyed this video please consider leaving a like, you can leave a comment telling me how it did, leaving feedback, tell me how to improve and all that stuff. You can also subscribe and that will help support the channel, will help people find me and all that fun stuff. So I've not been posting, I've got a lot of stuff to do at school and i got GTA 5 so I've been playing that recently. Um, yeah thanks for watching and I uh, hope you enjoyed this. And hopefully I'll see you next time.